which would not be my by my hand at all. At all. No, it's not my style. Well, that was to be expected. It was it was nice while it lasted. It definitely didn't pay itself uh, pay for itself, but whatever. Now the Numidians are. What is he doing? Surely he knows that there is no way that that's enough to take on my city. What if I build an assassin? He has no one with him. If I can assassinate the the general, I think that would be just the best thing ever. Alrighty, a unit of peasants versus that. I'm just not even gonna bother. A draw. <laughs> <laughs> a draw. We tie. Good, good fight. Good fight. I will speak with them at once. I'd like to offer you a ceasefire, but of course you don't. Yes, my lead. You guys are stubborn. I suppose that once the uh, Palma. Yay! You guys can build mines. I'm pretty. Didn't I have. No, that's the wrong one. Do I not have mines yet? At this time, it would be a sound strategy to build a temple of. Yeah, I could build a temple of Baal, but I don't want to. I want to build naval trade stuff. Um. I, great lord. I, my lord. Yes, mighty lord. Moving ashore. We're gonna go. Yeah, they are. Let's chat, shall we, guys? I'll get map info for you as well. Thanks, Macedonia. Wow, really? Are the Greeks already this week? I kind of. I kind of want to give the Greeks. Massilla, but I think that'd just be cruel. It'd be interesting, though, if I did capture this kind of area and I offered it to the Greeks. It'd be interesting to see the Greeks expand in this kind of area. You know, like into the um, into the rebels as opposed to where they usually would uh, against more pikemen. Your obedient service. Let's end the turn again. The temple of Baal was damaged. Oh no, whatever will I do? I'll just rebuild it. Sillies, you've done nothing. Where did he go? Mm -mm. Sir, I know you're around here somewhere. And I am coming for you. Just so you know. I'm not really all that fast. I don't see what all the hullabaloo is about. And of course, hullabaloo is a real thing. I don't even know what you're thinking if it's not. Why don't you uh, go up there? They're at war. They've broken their alliance. They are allies, and they have a ceasefire. Interesting. I wonder who's winning that fight. Hang on. Let me just take a look. I mean, it's usually the Egyptians. Yeah, overall they're doing better. Military, they're doing better. Production, wow, these guys have both just suffered. Territories, they're both on six. Uh, if I knock myself out of the picture... Neither one of them is really winning in territories. They haven't changed at all. Wow, but the population is where they're really suffering. Financially, though, uh, I think that the Seleucid Empire just always does better, I think. Set up that. Um, you guys don't even have walls yet. Where was I training Iberian infantry? Oh, I've already got them. Now I could have sworn somewhere It. 
Is it at Carthage? Where do I have the ability to train my next unit? I swear I did. Oh well, I must just be going crazy. We have a lot of money, so we need to build stuff. That's got stuff building, that's got stuff building. Let's send a governor into there. Who is you, you're you're fit to command. Oh you're not really, but you're better than the other guy. That's all you really have to be, is just be better than the other guy and you'll be fine. No, we want navy here. That's not navy. That is navy. Um, let's build some troops then. That ought to spend a bit of my money. Oh, really? The Skippy I are here as well? It looks like I've lost Corrales. Under attack. We are supreme. I, yeah, I don't think I can contend against both of them. Gauls are getting reinforcements. I mean, this is just... 9 to 70. Wow. I can't believe I didn't lose. Like, how do you hit a draw with that? Um, it's a lot of stuff built. I just don't know where to start. I'm gonna put the wooden palisade wall there just because I would rather them be built. Uh, you know, and have some kind of defense. Rather than just leaving myself wide open for attack. I mean I may as well just give my city over if I don't have walls. Well, not really. In fact that's probably how I prefer to fight without walls. Which I said earlier. So bonus points to you if you've been paying attention. Hmm. And what are the points good for you may be wondering? Well, you'll have to wait and see. By the way, they're not good for anything. I'll tell you that right now because, well, it's just how it is. The more trade rights I get, the better. That means more money, that means more military. More military obviously means more winning, I think. Alrighty, we're going to bring this ship around here. We're going to take our faction leader, our spy. Okay, fine. Spy, you jump in. Faction leader, these guys. Jump in. Mighty General, my liege. Jump in. That's an alright army, I suppose. Buff it with some mercenaries. We are going to uh, start to attack the Brutii and uh, hopefully. I guess what uh, saving the Brutii will do, no sorry, uh, killing the Brutii will do, is this still Greek? It is. By, uh, by cutting off the Brutii here, I think what will end up happening is if I can take out both of these cities so that they can't 
get these troops back and forth. The Brutia will end up dying here, because um, it looks like they haven't actually really done much yet, which is good. I'll just end the turn. So the Brutia will end up dying there, because they won't have the troops to constantly invade. Oh, look, yeah, see, here we go. We're getting uh, reinforcements, because they know the Brutia can't hold it on their own. Let's try to assassinate this guy. Oh well, he missed. At least he didn't die. Wait, hang on. I think that was the Seleucid Empire and the Pontic Empire, so that's okay. Really need to pay more attention. Oh, hang on. Cease the assault. Got a spy. So now. We make the assault. Masilla, you're expanding. Oh, right. <laughs> Forgot about that. Yeah, that doesn't really matter that you're expanding. I don't know how we keep tying. Like, that is uh, statistical improbability, but we keep doing it anyway. Alrighty. Here we are. Cheerio, chaps.